Hello, I'm Chris Holmstrom, and this is The Rundown. An ex-convict shot and killed the Riverside Sheriff's deputy. 32-year-old Isaiah Cordero was gunned down after he pulled the truck over in this suburban neighborhood yesterday. Cordero's killer was shot and killed by deputies after a freeway pursuit. Major progress at airports across the country as Southwest Airlines seem to be getting back on track after a major meltdown over last week. Southwest says they have realigned their crews and fleet, and they're hoping there will be minimal disruptions today. And finally, volunteers are working on Rose Bowl floats today before Monday's morning's parade. The float is from the city of Torrance, and it's called For the Love of Nature. Now here's Olga with a check your forecast. Hey Olga. Hi Chris and you know what the good news is the Rose Parade won't be until Monday the second and that means we are expecting dry conditions uh, for the big parade for Saturday though it is going to be a wet day even into the early part of your Sunday so yes 2023 hours away temperatures in the mid 50s uh, for the LA area at the stroke of midnight and in the 60s for New Year's Day again some sunshine expected by Sunday. Here's a look at our satellite radar tracker. You can see some of those showers starting to move in early in the day. Some light to moderate rain before things intensify as we head into the afternoon evening hours. By Saturday night, just before 11, look at that. Some very heavy rain where you see all those yellows and oranges. That's going to be through L.A., the Inland Empire, down into Orange County. Continuing heavy as we head into midnight and still winding down as we head into the early part of your Sunday. Snow levels are dropping as well, down to about 50. 5,500 feet, so those highest elevations being impacted. Some gusty winds tomorrow also with high wind watch in place for places like the Antelope Valley as well as our mountain areas, and we are looking at uh, some cool temperatures this afternoon. Below average still, upper 50s and low 60s for most of us. When we come back, a check of the roads with Kalina. All right, thank you. And remember, we're always streaming on CBS News Los Angeles. You can watch us anytime on our free CBS News app and Pluto TV. I'm Chris Holmstrom.